It's been a long time coming, but we're really excited to finally announce the production of the Arch 1S motorcycle. The 1S shares a lot of characteristics in the Care GT1, the feeling of a big, powerful American V-twin motorcycle. Where it differs from the Care GT1 is that it's a little bit more agile. I love the shorter wheelbase, the quicker handling, more of a sport-oriented riding position, sitting on top of the motorcycle rather than in it. I would say it offers a little bit more aggressive riding experience than the Care GT1. The 1S is our first single-sided swing arm, which is where the name came from. As with all Arch motorcycles, the 1S is graced with Olin's suspension, both the Olin's fork up front and Olin's shock on the back. We're using different wheels on the 1S. They're 17 inch front and rear. They're still carbon fiber, but they're a different lighter spoke design. The chassis on the 1S, even though it shares some visual similarities to the Care GT1, is completely different chassis geometry. Quicker steering, shorter wheelbase, a lower steering neck height, a little bit different composition in that it uses a billet aluminum backbone combined with billet aluminum side plates. Brakes are still ISR with a Bosch ABS system. We have dual six-piston calipers up front that are massive. The exhaust system on the 1S is really unique. It looks almost a little bit like a Cobra, and it projects the sound in a really nice tone and a really nice direction. Some of my favorite components on the 1S, obviously the single-sided swing arm, the generous use of carbon fiber, the rear tail section from a design perspective is beautiful. It sort of blends some aeronautical cues and some nautical cues. One of the real challenges from a design and engineering perspective was the fuel filler. I wanted it to be sleek, so we have this aluminum panel across the top that has the Arch logo. And on the top of the A, you flip it up and turn it. The entire hatch with the gas cap comes up out of the gas tank in one fluid motion. For the 1S, we've employed an entirely new dash instrument. It's an electronic display made for us by an Italian company, AIM. It handles a lot of the control system for the chassis of the motorcycle, so lights and starter function, these types of things, and it's well integrated into the entire theme of the front end on the Hornets. So it was really exciting in 2017 to take the 1S from a napkin drawing to finally a motorcycle that we could show the world. But since then, it's been five years in development and with the challenges with the world, I'm super excited to finally have this motorcycle here and ready to share with the world.